Hi guys, welcome to another video on Simulate. This video will cover labels and specifically text labels. And we'll use text labels to change the appearance of our work items. Right, first thing we need to do is to go over to our view tab. In the image library, we find a group of images that are already assigned to our model. I want to add two more to this model. So I'm going to find them in the work items folder. First one is the green ball. And I also want to add another one, the blue ball. All right. The green ball, I'm going to give another name. I will call it green ball. All right. And the blue ball, same thing. Blue ball. All right. We'll use those two images. To change the appearance of our work items as they progress through the model. Right, so the idea here is we'll have a green ball coming out of delivery, going to grinding and going to the wash, and at that point it will change to a blue ball and progress through the rest of the model. Right, the way to do that, double click on your delivery or your start point, head over to actions, and add a new label to change. Since we do not have any labels in this model at the moment, we add a new one. We'll call that image. This is important. You need to ensure that that's a text label. Click OK, OK. And now we can go and set the value of that label to, and we'll start off with green ball. Click OK, and OK, and OK. All right, let's just have a look and see if that worked. We'll run it. And you can see the green ball coming through. And those green balls are going to go through all the way to the end of my model because I haven't changed their appearance anywhere else. All right, so let's stop the model there. After the wash, I want to change the appearance of that work item. So I double click on that again. Choose actions, change the label, and I'm going to change that to blue ball. Alright, click OK and OK. To reset, I will start it again. We'll see the green ball coming through to the wash and then it changes into a blue ball. And the blue ball will continue through the rest of the model. All right, and that is how we make use of labels to change images using a text label. Thank you for watching.